Nasa to Susie's special, special, whatever. Those guys, you know, you remember those guys, the three Chinese guys? They're not cool. Don't tell them that. I'm cooler. Hi! Okay, never mind. Today we're gonna talk about something that is in the hip, in the zone. It is Pokemon Go Go Go. Cue music! We are going to talk about how when it comes out, everybody's going to go crazy. You're going to go crazy, you'll be like, oh, what's going on? And how do you know if you're crazy about it? Number one, everything you see around you looks like some Pokemon thing that you can catch. Well, look at all these male tanks. But I don't have enough Pokeballs to catch them though. It's another PG. Gosh, use fly! Use fly! Hmm. I wonder if I can catch this Pokemon. Huh. Do you know where Melf is? You might know. Noah, there are animals. Please, stop. Number two, everywhere you walk around, you're looking at ways so it looks like that GPS thing when like, you're running and be like, oh, is this, am I supposed to turn right now? Am I supposed to turn left? Please, be very careful, okay? Number three, every day is leg day. You're gonna wake up feeling, why am I so tired? Because you're walking around every day and you don't even realize it. Because you're becoming obsessed about it. So stop! Okay. So, <laughs> to help me out with managing your life and Pokemon Go, I have a good friend to intro to help me. To help me help you. Please, let me introduce to you. Ash? Hi, my name is Ash. I have no life because... Pokemon Go. Just kidding, my name is not Ash. <laughs> my name is Gabe and I will teach you together with Susie how to manage your life and Pokemon Go. And number one, no Mike, more, number one, Mike, when you play play Pokemon Go, uh, you gotta make sure that you are aware of your surroundings. Mm -hmm. Surroundings, mate. You know, in Australia, they're really nice trees. So, you know, instead of looking at your phone, maybe look at the tree so that you don't walk into the tree, mate. Yeah, yeah. So when you when you play Pokemon Go, I mean, I'm not saying that you can't play. I mean, you can play, but you know, just make sure you're aware of your surroundings. When you when you're out in the city, you know, when you walk in the city, you know, and then after that, the pedestrian red light comes on. Beep 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 beep. <laughs> means you know means you don't walk, bro. You don't walk. So when you play Pokemon Go, and then you're on the go, and then you're on the go, and then you walk, and then you come to the traffic and you stop, bro. That's where you call the game Pokemon Stop. And then when the green light comes back on, it's Pokemon Go. And then you go, bruh, that's how you be aware of your surroundings. Okay, you know the Pokemon? What's the slogan? Moto. Ah, Moto. Catch them all! Catch them all, but I say right, Pokemon catch some of them. You know why? Because people got things to do, yo. Ain't nobody got time to catch them all. Bruh, like, whatever, bro. So when you play Pokemon Go, you can just catch some of them because there are better things to do in life. Like, go and get a manicure or pedicure. Just kidding. Actually, yeah, you can. Because that is lifestyle. 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 So, yeah, moving on. Next point, Suzy. Point number three. Three. Time management. Time management. You need to set your priorities right. What is more important to the least important. Now, is Pokemon Go important in your life? Is Pokemon Go going to make you a leader of the world? No! The answer is no. Correct or not? No, correct. Right. Yeah. Right? See? Set your priorities. So what is your priorities? If you are studying, study first. If you're working, work first. If you're sweeping the floor, sweep first. first. He got it. He understand. Priorities. Priorities. I must do this and then do this, then only play Pokemon Go. Because you see, don't let Pokemon Go take control of your life. It is not that important. It is just a game. It's a game. It's a game. It's a game. It's a game. A game. A game. A game. Ha ha. A game. Okay. This is game. Ha ha. Point number four. Reward yourself with Pokemon. Okay, what you do? Like, personally for me, I watch Korean dramas. But I love Korean dramas. So what do I do? 
I study first for two hours, then I watch Korean drama. Oh, ah, so you do that with Pokemon? Pokemon Go! Go! And then what in Japanese? Hi! Hi! Uh, that was Korean. Come on, what are you? Point? Recapping. Point number one. Number one. Be aware of your Be surrounding. Aware. Be aware. Not a tapware, but aware. So, uh. Point number two. Point number two. Catch some of them. Catch some of them, mate. Some. Not all. Some. some. Not all. Because ain't nobody got time for that. Point number three. Number three. Time management. Please. Priorities. Point number four. Number four. Reward yourself four. with Pokemon Go. You can play, but make sure you got the balance. The balance. You do the work, then you play the game, but make sure you got the balance. balance. You do the work. Don't let it control your life. See, the main point is don't let it control your life. You have yeah. to find the balance. So that's all from us today. Okay, bye. This is my friend. Oh. Okay. Bye. I'm still here. Pokemon! I actually don't play Pokemon, but yeah. <laughs> Pokemon! <laughs>